Greetings and welcome back. Mingle's the name and Kingdom Come Deliverance is the game. Episode 11. Is that lucky? I don't know. 11 feels like a good number. We are going to do some shopping, y'all. <laughs> good stuff. So we were at the cobbler and checking out his wife, I guess. <laughs> doesn't look that old and we've got some goods to sell okay okay then sweep it sweep it <laughs> awkward where's Conrad is he up still coming there is, there is his uh, shop signage. So nobody ever sits in the front of Conrad's shop. Okay then, what do we have here? Steel. Yeah, Conrad, everybody's gonna come to your shop because of your wonderful torches you've got up at front. Oh, this is pretty. I wonder what the purpose was with this. Would it just like be replaced the fireplace beat what is this bread bandage nice packaging a string they should have placed some items on those shelves looks a bit lamer because it's empty ooh I like those semi see-through baskets wicker baskets wow that is so low the um View distance. Maybe there's things in the shelf after all. Nah. I'm too scared to walk closer. I might get cray cray. <laughs> okay, Conrad, let's talk. Now you don't want to look at me. God save you. What can I do for you? Thank you. Let's trade. Take care now. <laughs> What's up with this NPCs? Every time I start trading, like, take care now. Okay, uh, we would like to sell long distance arrow piercing. Yes, armor. Henry sh shirt. Yeah, Henry scarf. I want the skull cap. Do we want to hold on to the tight olive hose? Yes, that's Henry's, isn't it? Yes, sir. Ooh, I like that weapon lock. Oops, I forgot I sold his boots. His boots. But we can get the one pair back just for sentiment's sake. Okay, so we've got the hose, we've got the red scarf, and the shirt and I'll hold on to that black and white hood as well I like it what does it actually maybe I wonder if I that really looks so cool yeah since I'm not in the service of Scarlet anymore um, hmm yeah we're gonna rock that I look like a bandit kind of where is it? Did I sell it? Oops. Okay, never mind. Um, we'll 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 not um, wear it, but we also won't sell it, and we'll just hold on to one pair of boots. Just the yak of it. The yak. Burger sword. Hmm. Yeah. We'll hold on to that. Two. Okay. Oh, borohide. We can totally sell that. Armor, food, mm. other, bow hide, cobbler's kit, we want to hold on to that. Uh, I'm thinking I'm gonna, I guess we can read it for what it's worth. Okay, let's see what this guy's got for me to buy. Uh, she's forgot already what type of arrows I had weapons, uh, wounding arrows. And what is up with wounding arrows? 
Uh, okay. They can all vary in quality to piercing arrow, arrows is if you go up against armor opponents. Wounding, I'm guessing, is like a probably a arrow head, a traditional arrow head, probably to make somebody bleed. Damage over time effect, I'm guessing. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Okay, I'll just hold on to the 12. Oh, I've got torches to sell. Take three of them, please. I'm not going to bother to keep one on pebbles. Stinger. Short sword. Ooh, it's beautiful. That's the one I got in the treasure chest, isn't it? And I'm actually currently... Am I currently... I'm not fighting with burger sword, am I? No, I'm fighting with bedfellow. Mm -hmm. Okay, enough about that. Um, armor, no food. I like my dried fruits and boots, but we are currently still good. We are good on food. Let's see. Let's grab another marigold, and we won't be bothering with snaps. Nope. Uh huh. And he's got the Hercules and his diet. Uh, book. Uh, 77 Gobblers, Tailor's Kit. Let's grab uh, two Tailor's Kits. Yeah. For the heck of it, let's grab another five bandages. Okay, let's check out. Where's my basket? Check out. Close. <coughs> Okay, cheers, man. Cheers. Cool how he uses his left hand. Mount Pebbles. So I haven't been to the market much. What is that? Like a grocery trader? This is the butcher. We'll visit them next time around. Let's pay. I don't know if I paid my debt here, but let's do that. I guess that's not as important. Let's first go to the tailor. Good day to you. Good day to you. Trade pair. Good lord, watch over you. Yes, sir. Select all. 18. This guy is cheap. <laughs> I don't know how he makes a living. Thank you. And I'm not going to bother to buy anything at this stage. Bye. Okay. So, armor. Yes, we've got a coif. 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 I should have fixed those boots too, I guess. Mm. Uh, hunger. Oh, nourishment's quite low. Let's, let's have a bacon. Eat it, Henry. Mm hmm. What is honey? It does give you one energy. In a pinch, you can have nature's <laughs> energy <laughs> syrup, I guess. What's weighing me down? It's still encumbered. I forgot this dude's name. Apothecary. Is that your name? Good health to you. Ooh, fitting way to greet me. About that debt. <laughs> I won't pay anything. Ooh. Here you are. Thank you. I'm glad to see you're a man of honour. Sir. Is there anything else I can do for you? Um, let's trade, I guess. <coughs> Lord, watch over you. Food. Antlers, bandage, she's got a few frankincense. Uh, what is it? I don't know what it is. Gull, nettle, ooh, 
nice. He's got a lot of recipes and books. The alchemist dream. Okay. Food antidote. Yeah, I guess we can keep one on our person. Or on, yeah, what's his name? Pebbles. Mm -hmm. Honey. <laughs> Honey hoarder. Lazarus. Sure. Another hundred, my friend. Thank you for keeping me alive. It's strange to keep your door closed. Run. I should do the mini game where you shop and your sword again. No Armor Smith. I hope I can be of some humble service to you. <laughs> Man, he's getting some respect around you. God be with you. Uh huh. Soul. So I don't think. I think I don't think there's anything else I need to sell. Why is that olive hose is still dirty? Yeah, there's nothing else to sell. So it's basically just what is encumbering me? It's a mystery. Uh Pez. I care now. We're, yeah, we're just gonna just do it. 160. Okay, that's sorted. Let's put on the pants. We'll just swap it right here. And that's got a healing potion on it. <laughs> For what it's worth. Um, do you, can you, f yes, you can filter via condition. Okay, so that looks good. Weapons, good, good, good. Uh, I mean, so yeah. Okay, not that. Uh huh. Uh, armor. So what is? It's just the olive. How is that sturdy? Those. Oh, somebody's in the pull ring. Um, so where is the trousers? The red ones look better. I like the red ones more. That's not. Oh, it's that's irrelevant, I guess, because it's underneath those padded trousers. Cow, trousers. Now you pronounce that. Um. That looks so cool, isn't it? I'm not gonna roll in that quite yet. That's that's more mid to late game. We'll be rolling, rocking, and rolling a lot. Sweet. Okay, I believe that is most of our. Oh, fire! Let's do. What is encumbering Henry? It's still a mystery. Is that bloody hoof pick is gonna be with me for the rest of my life? Bandages are not. A it's not heavy. The spade. Mm, it's full. It's quite heavy. Okay. Nothing. The beer is quite heavy. Gapison. Yeah, it's that, that three. It's quite heavy. Okay. So it's, it's the armor, it seems. And also the weapons. Those two. Yes, yeah, stinger. Okay, cool. We'll sort that out. Let's see if I can sharpen the blade. Bait goods fresh from the oven. Come and get them. Phew, I should definitely. Honestly, I should make the draw distance higher. It feels very low. Uh, so, I'm currently using the mercenary's bedfellow. Reading time. Help. So much to read. If you want to maintain bladed weapons, you can save 
your repair kit and hone it yourself on a grindstone, which you can find at every smithy. Just approach the grindstone, start the process A, and select from the list which weapon you want to hone. The weapon must be honed along the whole length of the blade. You select um, right stick, left and right, and right stick up and down. The blade must be held at the correct angle to the grindstone. If the angle is too shallow, the edge won't be sharpened. If it's too steep, you can dull the blade. You control the angle using up and down right analog stick. You have to keep the grindstone turning using left trigger. You must also erect the correct Exert, sorry, not direct. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm not going to say anything about that. Can't read. You, you must also exert the correct pressure to make sure you hone the edge at all. Pressing also the pleat your stammer. To press, use right trigger. Whew. Grindstone, turn using left trigger. To press, use right trigger. Um, you can also... Recognize correct honing by flying sparks. Where there's black smoke coming from under the blade tells you you're damaging it. A well honed blade is smooth and shiny. Not erect. Oh, I have to pump it. <laughs> Go and. Okay, easy there, pal. Smoke, smoke, smoke. It keeps running out of energy. <laughs> Why did I do that? It was 100%. <laughs> That's weird. Okay, well, now we know. I'm, I'm gonna keep it at 100. I don't think I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna stand, keep going to get it to um, 100. Nonetheless, that's how it works. Now we know. <laughs> okay, so right, left analog stick back actually makes the whole series reverse. So good to know. Yeah. Okay, and then my OCD would never. Let me sleep tonight if I do not fix the workers' boots. I've got a cobbler's kit on my person. Let's quickly use that. Um, so, other cobbler's kit, just the one. Mm. I am. I'm here. I'm just gonna do. Yeah. That. Oh, where's a dude? There he is. Oh, you can work inside as well. Hmm. Fancy, fancy. God save you. What can I do for you? Um, repairs. May the Lord watch over. Sir. Whoa, my decorated riding boots has already taken one. Okay. Good. Oh, Henry. Outside, turn around, close the door. That's what you get for being bringing me Ch chickens. Okay, let's do that. Yeah. Oh, we might as well just fast travel. Okie dokes, fast travel. Oh, man, man, man. Yeah. Excuse me. Yeah. It's weird how people just keep walking, they clearly can hear the horse galloping. Yeah. 
Come on, what's the time? I don't think Teresa's gonna go for a walk with Henry. Mm, it's a luxury to go out walking in this place, it seems. She always just sits around, I don't know what's her problem. See? <laughs> yes, leave the doors open. Real pain in the ass when everything's closed. So let's grab, um, I guess we can grab two of them. And then we'll be moving from our inventory into this chest. Done with that one. Antidote. Uh, four, I guess. Yes. Okay, that's tied to Henry. Okay, Stinger, yes sir. Armor. Yes, yes. Is that it? Cool. So we are currently wearing everything. And then regarding the food, I guess we can five of the dried meats into the chest. We will hold on to the antidote. Um, and Good. Yeah, I'm not going to be keen on that. Poison. Oh, we've got two kits. A spade, we need all that. Okay, cool. All sorted. Let's move out. What's Henry's energy like? Uh, 73? Time of day? 5... Well, it's almost 3 p.m. Hey, sorry, 5. Yeah, it's almost 5 p.m. Let's see if she, we can go for a walk. If we can't, we'll just... Henry, I'm so glad to see you. what I've brought her. Let's... I brought you something. Jewelry. Yeah, let's give her the necklace. Oh, yes. It's weird for him to wear, I guess. A... Whew, that ring is quite expensive. Confirm. Oh, how? Is this for me? This must have cost you a fortune. Mm -hmm. But I like it very much, thank you. You really mustn't bring me any more gifts like that, or you'll spoil me. I hope so. 180 groschens a lot. Uh... So, uh, how have you been? I can't stop thinking about Scalitz. I know. It was hell. But life has to go on. Why not clear your head and try to forget about it? At least for now. What do you mean? Do you feel like a walk? That's not a bad idea. I've got lots to do right now. But I'd love to go another time. Will you come and see me again? As her ladyship commands. <laughs> you jester. Got nothing to say. <laughs> okay, so um, I'm thinking we should probably just sleep here. Then we can move out early. Early in the morning. Let's check. Um, so. Maybe something like that. Yep. I mean, if you've slept on a bench your whole life, what would the bench comfort be for you? Would it be for a person? I mean, a straw bed would be like a hundred and 
10% comfort in comparison. So how does Henry know what to uh, compare his comfort levels towards? Because it's only 50% comfort currently. Would Capon's... Uh, that objective. Would Capon's bed be 100% for him? Did, has he seen his bed and he's envious of his bed? I don't know. Ooh, Teresa is moving downstairs. Poor people don't have blankets or hides or something to sleep underneath. Just sleep like that. It's bubbling. I like these people's slow brewing meat. They just put it to the side and it's always ready to go. Um, well, that being said, his nourishment is 60, so I guess he would like to eat. Eat from pot. Nice and hot, see? 85. Let's give him a beer. Liquid bread, a satisfying drink that is all, that also fills the belly. Don't overdo it, lest you succumb to alcoholism. Let's not say, hey. Whoa, that nourishment of the beer is good. Seven. Yeah. So let's have a look. Durability, it's infinite, infinite, infinite. Sweet. Okay, so we'll be moving some of these to the horse. Not yet. And I'm telling you why I'm hoping to buy a new saddle. Guess we, I guess we have to shut this. Even though people can crawl in through the windows and the doors don't have any locks. <laughs> Different, oh, they do. Is it raining? No. Good. Devils. Okay, fast travel. New York. Let's do it. I like the stars, they look so pretty. Ambush. Um, escape. Oh. You're dead. Yeah. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead, man. Ah, I can't see nothing. Yeah. <laughs> the escape failed. Oh. Oh. Not nice. Not nice. The escape failed, but then I just right over the way. Is this Mills? Miller's? Yes. Okay, so I guess we shall continue our journey. Fast travel, yes sir. What I was about to say is like, obstacle, what's going on here? Uh, you see an obstacle blocking the way. Fortunately, before anything happened, it could be an accident. Once again, we fail. Oh, this is cool. But, but this Post looks like... Yeah. Oh, pebbles. You've discovered Rato Woods. Yeah. <laughs> oh, he's determined. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Where's he at? Oh, he's actually firing at me. Yeah. No, dude. You're not gonna get away like that. <laughs> you, you you engage me, then you try and like. Is that that was that a hit shot? Oh, AI is broken. Oh no, you dead. Yeah. Is it left? He's making me go all fraud, yeah. This is good, like so. Yeah. Cool. 
bitch. It's a gimmick. Screw you, man. Set a trap and everything. Where's that? Bastard, did he run away? No, he didn't. I'm mad. Cool. Bacon! Ooh, nice, nice, nice. Ah, leave that dirty cumin tunic. I don't want it. Don't really want that. Hmm. Yeah, it's looking good. So we won't put it on the horse. No, I'm encumbered. Let's walk over here. So what is... Jump. Yeah. X. Where is this trap of his? This roadblock. Here it is. No? Was it back? Is it gone? Yeah. Oh, here it is. Let's have a look. So you basically just kind of burn and chuck over a wagon with branches and a bit of wood. It's quite strange that that human by himself tried to ambush somebody. Out of curiosity, what did he do to my armor? Not much. He hit the pauldrons and the gavison. Alright. Interesting. Yeah! Oh! Just fast travel, you're making me mad. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right, we'll be going there in, in game. No fast travel for us. Winding in. Still here? Or they just stay in a? That dog is here. I'm gonna go mad. Nope. How's the sun shining? Okay, one less cumin to bother to worry about. And we'll just stand here by the fire and wait for three hours. Because I know, who knows when this woman comes out. A lot of England you just stand around. Here she is. Good. Okay. Oh. Where's my psychic? Give me that. It's heavy. 
No, 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 Zora. You're not going Good nowhere. health to you. Good luck, then. Good luck, then. So, let's first see what we can sell to her. Oh, nice. Seems we can sell... Let's sell the... Uh, well, no, let's not. Yeah, let's sell these over. How much cash do you have? 400. Mm. Comparison, you're wealthy. Yeah, I'll keep that for Teresa. Give it to her next time. We don't want to shower her with gifts once off. Maybe. We... God, I don't want the dirty bacon. You can have a cumin bacon. It's dirty. What else do we have of value? Sure. Must put the spade on the horse. Okay. That's good. Okay, so we get 188. And now we're going to buy. So. Fine subtle six hundred. How much do I have? Five hundred and forty-four. Oh, these things are way expensive. Uh, yeah, I don't have that sort of money. Uh, sheepishly, I'm gonna take it back. <laughs> let's let's uh, arrange this according to uh, price. So the the brown. Caparison. I guess we can take one of those. Yeah. It actually gives a bit of armor. Three. Okay, and then... Uh, plain riding spurs. Yeah, he does need it, doesn't he? Um, dirty. Plain brittle. Okay. Um, unfortunately, we will not be selling our um, saddle and plain brittle. Way too expensive. What is the price of your saddles? Maybe I can just buy a one k. Yeah, I would not be buying any. Okay, that is what it is. Remove. Okay, so we pay a hundred. And we get a Caperson and Riding Spurs. Close. <laughs> Let's put it on. I wonder if she can... If she... I don't think she even repairs it. What, what am I going to do with it? It's like zero condition. <laughs> ah! Where are you going? No, Zora. No, please don't. Please don't. Please don't. Yeah, she doesn't repair it. Okay. Good luck then. Mm-hmm. Shut up. So that's where you sleep. Now I know where to get you next time. Okay. Move these to the horse as well. No need to plug it around. Good. 
All right. 81 out of 86, always encumbered. And then finally, let's sort out the horse. Um, level 5. And capacity goes up by a little. Okay, so it is broke and the capacity goes up by 20 where it could be a lot better. So that's fairly okay then still. Okay, sweet. I guess he just ties it to the horse back in a little rope bundle or something weird. That's sorted. Way too expensive to replace it with new ones. So we are looking mighty... He's a wannabe uh, knight. I mean, look at that. Looks cool. Okay, fast travel. So, uh, we need to go to Uchir. Uchir. Zich. Zich. Ichir. Um, let's make it thematic. I guess we're just gonna do it ourselves, just driving. This is the yeah. direction. And we will ride out. Yeah. So hopefully the horse will control better with the spurs. Right turn here, full way. Oh, this guy's got a fancy canopy for your stroll in the middle of the field. Did we discover this uh, shrine? It seems we have not. Nice way to pop, but um, awkwardly. Yeah. Yeah. I'm still going the right way. We should probably check. No, see? Um. I mean, how is that giving you better control over the horse? I mean, if, it's, if you kick it in its uh, flanks, does it just respond better? Interesting question. And I've never played with the DLCs before, so that's also going to be fun. But I believe if you get to rebuild one of the towns, that's going to be awesome. Uh, the DLC of Teresa, I've got no idea what that entails. That's also going to be something interesting sight. And why is this an interesting sight? Uh, we're not going to get into that now. Yeah! 
назад уйти, лучше здесь. I know this promised I won't always travel. Find out where the limping bandit lives. We won't always uh, travel yeah. like this. It's only like once or twice, but the initial, the first time, we'll definitely do it for immersion and for like the progression and for the thematics of it. But yeah, going forward, I'll probably fast travel. So, what is this? The butcher on the right. And um, I'm, I'm going to go straight to the scribe. Oh, there's the uh, an event. I wonder if we can maybe just kind of try and bypass it for now. Yeah. Where's the scribe at? Fast travel point, sweet. Oh, okay, yes, central. Have a look at those melons! <laughs> have a look at those melons! Yeah! Have, have a look at my way. Oh, shit, this guy's standing here all alone, just shouting at the top of his voice. Here it is. Let's do it. The girls can stay here. Apparently, what uh, what I've watched on um, YouTube documentaries, they had like little hooks, and they would just hang them in a in an arrangement. So now I'm thinking to myself, if it like was slightly stormy or something as such, um, that, that would have been interesting. If if it, how often the roofs would, you know, some of them would blow off or something. I guess. Oh sweet, it's got a, like a library game. That's nice. Don't know how secure his uh, terms is. There we go. Scribe. God be with you. <laughs> From that angle his eyes look like a black like a demon's. Uh, the fellow with a limp, I guess we can ask. I'm looking for a fellow who lives here, but I don't know his name. Do you know anyone with a limp? Must be that farmhand, Lubosch. I don't know what the hell you'd want him for, and I don't much care. He's got a cottage on the edge of the village near the stream. Okay. I'd like to learn to read. You? Hmm. You don't look like the makings of a priest or clerk. But why not? I've taught all sorts. Bear in mind, it won't be all that easy. You'll need plenty of time and a few groschen for my trouble. All right. I don't want to waste time. We can get started. The sooner I master it, the better. Very well. I will require some groschen from you, though, and set aside at least a couple of days so I can put you through your paces, if indeed time is of the essence. Here are your groschen. Then we may as well start. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm good with that. No. He did break his vow. But better than to dishonor it here. May he follow his heart. So I guess um, the main quiz will probably stand still. Wake up, lad. It's time we were getting on. It's a bit crummy for immersion, but still. <sighs> So, let's see you read a bit. For interest's sake, I There's guess. There's a book here on the table. Try to read it. Will I manage? You ought to be able to. It's a simple text. Come back once you've worked your way through it. Okay. Let's leave this as this, and let's finish the investigation, and you can come back and read. Sense, I guess. 
Those shingles are a bit strange up there. <laughs> that guy with the melons again. Have a look at those melons! Yeah! afternoon. <laughs> Move along, citizens. Move along. There's nothing to see here. That's what you call nothing to see. I'd like to know what something to see looks like. By the keys of St. Peter, this is all I need. We'll have to send word to Sir Hanush. That might not be necessary. Who are you? I'm Henry of Scalitz, in the service of Hanush's Captain Bernard. I'm investigating the attack at Neuhof, and I think this could be related. Well, I'm the bailiff of Auschwitz. And I say, we don't want any of that kind of trouble around here. What makes you think this has anything to do with Neuhof? One of the folk at the stud farm recognised someone from Auschwitz among the bandits. We have no bandits or murderers around here. Really? They say he had a limp? Shit. Well, allow me to introduce you to Limpy Lubosch. Or all that's left of him. Sakra. Oh, nothing's ever easy. I'll have to take a look around and ask a few more questions, if that's all right with you. You can take this mess off my hands and welcome to it. As for. What else there is to find out, I don't know. But look and ask all you like. Gore. Lubosch. Ain't no mole. When did you find the body? And did anyone see anything? Just now. And nobody saw or heard anything. I don't know how they could gut him like that without someone hearing him scream. Who was Limpy Lubosch? A poor crofter and a scoundrel. Can't say I'm too surprised what happened to him. He kept company with all sorts of vermin. He was always getting into some kind of trouble. Punch-ups in the tavern and what have you. Do you happen to know where he was on the night of the Neuhof raid? I've no idea. He kept his distance from other folk, so you never knew if he was away or holed up at home. Did he have any kith or kin in the village? Mm, none. A loner he was. I don't know the last time I saw him with anyone. Has he been up to anything suspicious lately? Hmm. I don't know. The last few days he didn't go anywhere. He was home the whole time, but he always kept everyone in the village at arm's length. How come he limped? He got that from some villainy or brawl a long time ago. <laughs> Another thing about Lou, boss. No, he went through all of that. Okay. I guess let's get straight to it. Might as well get it over with. Investigator Henry Inspect A bed. <laughs> no, dude. <laughs> Rob. 
Nothing unusual. Nothing unusual. Rub, 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 rub. Okay. I'm gonna rob the man. Judas. Hmm. Looks like this is meant to be a warning. But for who? And why? Maybe the gang had a falling out. But a bandit who knows how to write isn't something you see every day. Shot, but I'm probably gonna fail miserably. But who knows? So, this is the kitchen, living area, I guess you can call it. Sit, sit, sit. Sit, sleep. And that's Henry's preferred way of sleeping on the bench. So, be it. Why do you guys make it so hard for me? Really dry vibrant. This is extremely hard. Hmm. Xbox remote vibrates like crazy. Come on, man. I really want to get better at this. It's a lot of money each time you try. So you have to push down on the thumb pad left, the th stick, the lock stick left. That's just crap, to be honest. So, right analog stick, I mean, you can see it just looks around. That's the sweet spot, I mean, and then you push the left analog stick down, up, left, left it seems. I mean, really? Scar annoys me, really annoys me. God be with you. May the Lord watch over you. So, if memory serves me, I believe he's got a little something we can. That's a nice fruit tree. For some odd reason, I thought he's got something buried in his yard.
Come, Pables. Um, I'm just gonna have a quick look. I'm gonna, I'm going to read up on e easier ways to lockpick or uh, just guides. I'm, I'm gonna still try doing it with the, the way I've been doing it now with the, with the normal, the hard setting. I'm not gonna set it to the easier one, but it's just yeah, two chests now. That's annoying me. Where I want to know what's, what's in it. I'm quite sure there was something buried in his garden. In his yard. Uh, seems I'm mistaking this for another guy. Okay. That's sweet. I guess we'll... Uh, we'll go reading. You find out more about it. I'm missing something. Except in the chest, of course. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, I'm, I was smug. I didn't. I'm an ungrateful pup. I didn't want to help um, play Shaq. So this is what you get. Because uh, he, he learns you how to lockpick and makes it a lot easier. Kissing Henry is uh, regretting that now, right about now. I know I am. Uh, so, you, oh, this porch almost looks like a shovel. Okay, well. This is a good place to finish. Thank you for watching, joining me for yet another uh, episode. Until the next one, you keep safe. As always, Lagadach and